Morning, El Camino. It's Pastor Bruce. I just met last night with one of our prayer groups. Uh, they meet weekly, and we were meeting online, and we were praying. And last night, in particular, we decided to focus our prayer time for our country, uh, for our leaders, our, our nation, our cities, and our church. And and we were praying and asking God to um, do great things and have mercy and uh, forgiveness and repentance and all those things that we felt like we needed to be praying for as, uh, as individuals, as a church, as a, as a people, as a nation. Um, one of the verses that we read, and, and it's a prayer from Daniel chapter 9, verses 18 and 19. Here's how it reads. The second half of verse 18 is where, where I picked it up here. It says, We do not make requests of you because we are righteous, but because of your great mercy. Lord, listen. Lord, forgive. Lord, hear and act. For your sake, my God, do not delay, because your city and your people bear your name. Daniel was praying for his city, for his people. We want to do the same. We have an opportunity, um, unique as it is, to be involved in our government, in the policies and the, the leadership. and We have that unique opportunity here in America. I want to encourage you. Yes, we need to vote. Yes, we need to be engaged. Yes, we need to pray. We're asking God to do a, a, a great thing, to, to bring about a renewal in our country. We need Him to do it. So we pray and seek His face and repent. It's not a thing of, of righteousness. It's not because we deserve it. We are seeking his mercy for us as a people, for us as a nation, for us as a church. Be encouraged, church. Pray, move, vote, act, repent. Seek his face. See you soon, church.